In this video, we will discuss some Java generics interview questions and answers for beginners. What is the difference between question mark versus question mark extends object? A question mark is a wildcard, okay, and it can have three forms unbounded wildcards, upper bounded wildcards, and lower bounded wildcards. Unbounded wildcards means there's only one question mark, okay, just a question mark there, and it represents a list of unknown type. We are not aware of type of this list. Upper bounded wildcards has the extends keyword, okay? So anything that extends number can be put into this list, okay? So it the number itself can be put into this list or its subtypes like integer and double can be put into this list, okay? Now lower bounded wildcards will have the super keyword in it, okay? So question mark super integer. So it can have a list of integer or its super types like number and objects. So an object is inherently the super type of all the classes in Java, right? So number Numbers and objects can be put in this list along with integer. Now coming back to the main question, what is the difference between question mark and question mark extends object? Now since object is the inherent super type of all types in Java, we would assume that list question mark equal to list object, but that is not true. Okay, unbounded wildcards are reifiable. So reifiable types are those types that are not erased at compile time. Okay, and will be present in the runtime. Okay, as a general rule, all the generic types are erased. Okay, they are type erased and are not refiable that means they will be erased at compiled time and will not be present in runtime okay so the generic type will only be present in compiled time it will not be present in runtime but refiable types are present at runtime also so unbounded wildcard this one will be present at runtime also so for example list string and map integer comma string are not reifiable so they will be type erased okay so they will be present only in compile time not runtime list question mark map question mark question mark are reifiable so they will be present at runtime as well so the list question mark extends object is not reifiable so this is a difference list question mark and list question mark extends object list question mark is reifiable this is not reifiable this is type erased okay this process of type erasing is called type eraser process so this is a notable difference okay non reifiable types cannot be used in certain situations such as in instance of operator okay so we will see this in an example so in this example we have used instance of operator with the unbounded wildcard this code compiles fine but if we use instance of operator with this question mark extends object generic type this will not compile this will give a compile time error so in this answer we covered in the next two questions as well what is type eraser in generics what are upper and lower bounded wildcards in generics so let's move on to the fourth question now the fourth question is can you pass list string to a method which accepts list of type object no and the answer is no you cannot do that so the object is a super type of string but list of type object is not a super type of list of string okay we have to make this clear let's understand this with an example suppose i create a list of strings okay in line number one i have done that then i create a list of object and i try to assign this string list to this object list okay in the line number two this is not allowed by the way in java but let's assume if it is allowed what will happen now i add a new object in this list of object which is fine line number three is fine now in line number four since this is a list string i try to get the first index of the string in a string variable okay but it is an object right we added an object in this so we are attempting to assign an object to a string which is completely wrong that is why java will throw a compilation error in line number two itself okay so the answer to this question is no it is not allowed guys if you like the video if you like our content please like the video and subscribe to our channel and if you have some feedback please comment on the comment section of the video me and my colleague have around 14 years of experience in tech and we are trying to share it as much as possible via this channel so please continue watching our channel uh, and thanks for watching our video keep learning and most importantly enjoy the process of learning thank you